Adam Vogts and Sean Marsh in world record 449 run stand. Adam Vogts brought up his first double century and Sean Marsh added 182 runs to combine for a world record four wicket partnership as Australia reached a formidable 583 to 4 at lunch on Friday on the second day of the first test against the West Indies. The 36-year-old Vogues went to lunch on 269 not out after he and Marsh shared a 449-run stand that eclipsed the previous four-wicket world record of 437 set by Sri Lanka's Megula, Ja Jordan and Flint Samara against Pakistan in Karachi in 2008. Marsh was out just before lunch, caught in the deep by Darren Brado off the bowling of left arm spinner Joe Mawarak in 3 158. Mitchell Marsh, Sean's brother one was batting with Vogues at the break. Vogues and Sean Marsh, who came together at lunch on the first day with Australia at 121-3 came close to setting Australia's biggest ever test partnership. 451 for the second wicket by Da Bradman and Bill Ponsford against England at the Oval in 1934. Vogue's double century also set the highest score in the Hobart test overtaking Ricky Pontane's 209 against Pakistan in 2010. Australians' 438 runs on the first day was the biggest single-day score conceded by the West Indies in their test history. The West Indies received some positive news on Friday. Scans cleared Shannon Gabriel of a left ankle fracture but the fast bowler will take no further part in the Hobart test and possibly the tour. Gabriel, who left the pitch during the final session Thursday, was seen walking with the aid of crutches at the ground on Friday.